In the middle of the market pandemonium rumors of a stock price so audacious and surprising that it challenges the status quo, what if I told you that the probability is larger than you believe? Get ready for an adventure via the numbers, forecasts, and patterns that can help solve the mystery behind the pricing of Tesla stock. This isn't just conjecture, there are significant growth prospects from its current status. Target, in this video, we're presenting a well-researched projection on Tesla's stock trajectory in 2024 using sound calculations and fundamental valuation. We'll also discuss market expectations from now until the end of 2024 with the most recent economic indicators in hand and a clearer Federal Reserve policy. Direction in light of the large company's third quarter earnings, the projection is getting clearer. In conclusion, we will examine long-term option positioning in Tesla, examining whether the bets are placed on a rise, fall, or stable hold of the stock. This insight may provide a useful perspective, but before we begin, please make sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons and ring the notification bell. Without further ado, let's get started. Currently, Let's examine the market insights. Current economic data points to a stable labor market that is neither overheated nor indicating a recession is on the horizon. The Federal Reserve, which usually waits to consider lowering interest rates until inflation stabilizes at its target rate of 2%, has unexpectedly adopted a bullish stance that suggests possible policy shifts based on market performance. However, Bostick's insights suggest that the Fed may be more proactive and may consider rate cuts sooner if the trajectory of inflation appears to be aligning with their long-term goals. In response to economic pressures and as a means of promoting growth, this preemptive strategy may reflect a more dynamic approach to monetary policy than in previous cycles. It is anticipated that by the latter half of 2024, inflation will reach the Fed's target, paving the way for more accommodative financial conditions in the technology sector earnings. Although Apple has reported a dip from the previous year, the narrative is still strong despite certain volatility, and this hasn't caused a larger market setback. The tech industry's overall strong performance indicates resiliency and the capacity to adjust to the current economic circumstances. The market's response, or lack thereof, to Apple's decline also reflects investor trust in the industry's fundamentals and resilience. Investors appear to have processed and processed the earnings reports. Maintaining a steady course despite inconsistent financial results, the collective market's reaction demonstrates a cautious but constant optimism over the tech industry's long-term growth potential. Recessions are viewed as disruptive forces in the market because of their unpredictable nature and capacity to market volatility during 2022 signal economic downturns, especially on the NASDAQ, was mostly caused by the Federal Reserve's swift rate hikes, which heightened concerns about an approaching recession. In the past, markets have handled rate increases gradually quite effectively. Cycles like the one from 2005 to 2008 are characterized by the speed and unpredictability of recessions which unsettles markets when tangible indicators of a recession, such as weak GDP or low payroll data, appear. The level of uncertainty surrounding the probable recession's depth and severity puts the market's ability to withstand bad news to the test. It's predicted that such worries will surface in the first quarter of 2024, possibly causing a marked downturn and the Federal Reserve to cut rates. Despite these forecasts, the consensus suggests that the economy could see a sharp deceleration from the 5% growth rate. The outlook for the end of 2023 and the beginning of 2024 isn't particularly optimistic with predictions of an economic slowdown and possibly even a negative GDP, according to certain metrics like the Atlanta Fed GDP and OutTracker. The current attitude is tactically positive, supported by earnings that haven't caused the markets to tremble too much. This cautious optimism is temperated with a plan to maintain liquidity for probable market declines when recession worries materialize. The reasons for this cautious optimism are a supportive Federal Reserve lowering Treasury yields and the hope of decreasing inflation. While the beginning of 2024 may present challenges, it could pave the way for a strong bull market as the year goes on. It is expected that once a recession hits and its scope is understood, whether mild or severe, the markets may rally, particularly in the latter half of 2024, benefiting from low federal fund rates and the subsequent increase in liquidity sectors sensitive to interest rates like those related to Tesla are anticipated to perform well in such an environment. Analyzing the market's trajectory and projecting a tactically bullish stance for the remainder of the year, as well as identifying current lower prices, particularly for Tesla as investment opportunities. This analysis leads to a tactical approach of cautious investment with readiness to capitalize on opportunities as they arise. As the first and second quarters of 2024 draw near, a downturn is anticipated with potential market corrections triggered by growing recession concerns. This time frame is viewed as a fantastic time to buy, especially since Tesla is anticipated to gain from falling interest rates on the fronts of valuation and consumer financing. The market is expected to be strong and aggressive in the second half of 2024, which is good news for small and mid-cap companies that have recently underperformed. Investors are advised to save money now 
in order to leverage any market declines brought on by recession fears, even though these are not according to financial advice. This course of action makes sense given market trends around Tesla's. Projected 2024 prices. Variability exists. As of the most recent report, the company's production capacity was estimated to be 2.35 million vehicles, with plans to increase. Elon Musk has set an ambitious growth target of 50% annually, which may not be met every year and may not materialize into a significant increase by 2024. The first quarter of 2024 earnings per share forecast appears likely to surpass Wall Street's more conservative delivery estimates of 2.1 million vehicles. The following quarter's earnings per share have been adjusted downward to reflect the difficult task of predicting Tesla's financials amid expansive projects like the potential construction of Giga Mexico Wall Street's full year 2024 in recent months. Tesla's EPS expectations have also dropped from $4.80 to $394. Despite this downward revision, the lower EPS forecast could make Tesla an even more alluring investment, even though it complicates the valuation process. When projecting Tesla's earnings per share for 2024, the primary focus is on its car business, which is considered the most significant factor, while acknowledging that the energy and services sectors are also crucial. Simplifying the analysis of deliveries and margins is the chosen approach because it has proven accurate in past delivery predictions for Tesla for context. This dynamic market scenario highlights the importance of staying informed and ready to act on investment opportunities as they arise. In Q3 2023, automotive revenue was $19.625 billion, with each vehicle valued at $435,500. Several things could affect this average sales price ASP in 2024. Lower interest rates from the Federal Reserve may result in cheaper borrowing expenses, enabling Tesla to perhaps increase car costs as a result of lower monthly payments of $5,000 hypothetical price increase might raise the ASP to almost $51,000. Furthermore, consumers may be able to endure price rises of up to $7,500 thanks to the Inflation Reduction Act tax credit, giving Tesla the freedom to change prices while maintaining affordable monthly payments. Assuming a middle ground average selling price of $53,000 and anticipating 2.3 million deliveries, total revenue could reach $122 billion, indicating a significant increase in revenue. After subtracting the anticipated $37,500 cost of goods sold each vehicle, the profit per vehicle would be around $15,500. A total profit projection of about $35.6 billion is obtained by multiplying this profit by the number of deliveries. However, these figures are subject to significant variation. For example, if Tesla had 3 billion shares and all other factors remained constant, the EPS would be approximately $188, an unlikely scenario. Taking net margins into account at roughly 55%, the EPS may be roughly $644, which would be significantly different from Wall Street's current estimates. The market does not believe that Tesla car prices would rise in 2024, but the company's latest earnings call revealed that affordability of monthly payments is a key component of its plan. According to this insight, Tesla may hike prices in defiance of existing market expectations if interest rates decline. This analysis shows a scenario in which, if these conditions materialize as anticipated, Tesla's 2024 EPS might surpass current projections. Elon Musk's focus on the affordability of monthly payments, independent of the vehicle's total cost, raises the possibility that Tesla will raise prices when borrowing gets more affordable. This pricing flexibility is seen as a crucial component of Tesla's business strategy, particularly if interest rates decline and make loans more accessible. Examining the Wall Street conservative EPS projection from three months prior, which was approximately $5 with an EPS of $4.80 and a forward price to earnings ratio of approximately 58, Tesla's potential stock price for the upcoming year is estimated to be around $278,840. However, given that the current PE is approximately 70, a more reasonable expectation might be higher if Tesla's forward P were to reach 90, reflecting significant EPS growth and lower interest rates. In a scenario that is both cautious and hopeful, Tesla's stock may hit new highs, perhaps as high as $432. A 2% rate cut might yield an EPS of $515 and a PE ratio of 75, which would translate into a stock price of about $38,625. This would be an increase providing Tesla increases pricing gradually and effectively controls growth expenditures. In the worst case, an EPS closer to the current $394 Wall Street consensus may be observed. The stock price. It might be about $275, $180 if this were multiplied by a P of 70, which would account for no price hikes, a decline in demand, and delivery quantities falling just short of the 2.3 million mark. The stock price may range from roughly $432 to $1,486 in the best case scenario, which takes into account an APS of $540 and a P ratio of 80 to 90 reflecting Tesla's price rises and stable demand. 
If the EPS were to reach 26 and the P reach 90, the price could fly to $1,540. These projections highlight the importance of Tesla's EPS in determining the company's stock price. While future spending market outcomes and average selling prices are the main source of uncertainty, predictions show that Tesla's stock price has the ability to rise significantly over its current value, with a range of modest rises to new highs. Although the current price of Tesla, at about $1,220, is considered to be a good time to buy, there will likely be a period of weakness at the beginning of 2024 due to recession worries and the market's propensity to overreact to new cycles. In spite of this, simple computations using the company's earnings per share EPS and the price to earnings P ratio are used to anticipate the prices of Tesla by the end of the year. The analysis considers a scenario in which Tesla's P ratio, which is currently at 70, might considerably improve with the current 5.5% federal funds rate. This improvement is anticipated as a result of a number of variables, including price increases by Tesla, improved margins, and a possible decline in the Fed funds rate. The contention is that, in the long run, the cautious forecasts might not adequately account for the upward potential in Tesla's stock value. This concludes our in-depth analysis of Tesla's financial outlook and stock potential. The market is clearly bullish on the company, as evidenced by the significant call activity seen for a range of strike prices up to 2025. Beyond that, the calls greatly outnumber the puts, displaying a 21 ratio that highlights the market's optimism regarding Tesla's future performance. Despite anticipated early 2024 market jitters brought on by recession worries, we have looked at the elements that could lead to Tesla's stock price increase, such as increased growth rates, favorable margins, prospective price increases, and decreasing Fed funds rates. With the alternatives, Tesla's long-term prognosis is positive. The market is showing a strong desire for expansion right now, and we'd love to hear your opinions. How likely do you think it is that Tesla's prices will rise in 2024? How do you think the Fed's interest rate decisions will affect Tesla's stock? Will you be? Changing your investing strategy in light of these forecasts? Please share your responses in the space provided below, and don't forget to like insightful market analysis and stock updates may be found every day by subscribing to Tesla Stock News. Thank you for watching, and we hope to see you in the future video.